We're on our way back. This is the intro. Powdered snow. Let's go. That part. I don't need that. No, I don't need to do the dirt. I only need the powdered snow. Oh, okay. Well, that's what we're going to do is we're going to do the powdered snow anyway. So, yep. Brought the wrong shoes. Okay. So we have a ways to go. So I guess we're just going to keep on going. But at least we could break the snow with a bucket. I did bring food, tools, torches, and all that fun stuff. Okay. Top of the snow. And the first number... Oh, okay. Yep. Leather shoes. Leather shoes. Uh, Well, you know, no, I came this far. I don't want to keep doing this. Why am I still freezing? There we go. Now, move your powdered snow. Oh my gosh. How much powdered snow? I didn't even bring my skis, man. Well, this is the beginning of a lovely stream. Oh, go away. Oh, what is that? Is that a zombie villager? It is. Well, we'll just take care of him right now. Let's put down a torch. Oh, that's right. I have empty pockets. So, yeah. If we do anything, yep, lots of zombie villagers. Not wanted. Okay. Yeah, I brought extra. Okay, well, this is the zombie bacon because it's just a pudding and system. How was everybody's Tuesday? Because it was a trepidatious Tuesday. I think that would be a good sort of word to describe it. Maybe. Oh, wait. So apparently carrot thing. So if you ever run out of tools and resources for tools, in mind, food. Food will at least break trees and other items. Oh my gosh. And torches. But if you don't have coal to make torches, right. Uh, no, now I seem to be going... There. Three. Oh my gosh. <sighs> okay, so most of this stream is going to be Mama digging herself out of snow. Which I guess in a few weeks most of us will be doing. Because everybody's just kind of going, Oh my gosh, it's winter and it's going to be bad. And it's like, it's winter. It's winter. When was winter ever nice? I mean, there might have been a few where it was rainy and mildish, but, you know, it was still winter. Okay. Torch here. I was like, wow, what are the... Wait a minute. Is this... I should probably not play around because that is on the edge and there is a spider and spiders like to knock you around. Where'd you go? Aha! Nope. I don't... There he is. He tried to fool me. No, you come here because I'm actually... Yeah. See? I'm actually chasing a mob. But did you see how close I got? I don't want to get close. I don't want to do that. 
Okay, so... Is this the cave? Or is this another cave? Because obviously I've been here. But that doesn't look like the right cave. I don't remember lighting the other cave up. Let's, let's take this meandering a little more safer. Right? Let's, let's just take that of safety. You be quiet. Okay, now. Oh, that is... Wow! I'm just going to walk right through that skelly. Okay. Oh, and I'm going to run right at the creeper. Hey! I flew without elytra. That's cool. Don't think that's the way I'm supposed to do it, but there it is. I did it, and it happened. Okay, obviously I'm at this cave. Let's check out this cave. Yeah, the coordinates don't match, but... You know, so goes life in the big city. Wow. Oh. So, we went in a circle because the house is over there and this is the cave with the other ancient city that we've already conquered. How did we go in a circle? Yep. Okay. This is why you never ask a narwhal to, to use a GPS. Nope. Nope. We would just get angry and go in a circle. We'd be like, no, because we swim in circles. Okay. So I'm trying to reach the first number of, th like, not negative, positive, three, three, nine. This is not the way to do that. But we went this way last night. That's why I took, I, I got a head start before I street. Why am I, no, that's why. Let's come along, little doggy. Because I know that we were pretty far away. Because I remember we ran through the snow, right? And we saw our path partially. I just still don't understand how we ended up in a big giant circle. <sighs> okay. Hey, at least we respond in the right place. Okay, we're going to take a minute. I'm glad you had a good day, Shay. Really glad. Okay. I have no idea. That error message pops up quite often. And yes, I'm talking to myself. Wait a minute. You know what would make this go so much easier? Well, first of all, to get rid of the crap in my pocket. Let's see if we have leather boots, right? Because then we could go so much faster. And I, you go despawn. Thank you. Leather boots. Leather. Well, we have two leather here. See, I wish we could take zombie flesh and turn it into leather. But that's a mod. So, don't really have those. Okay. But I have tons and tons of... Well, 
I guess I don't have tons and tons of leather. Oh, wait, there's four. I think that might be all I need. Like, two for each boot. Maybe? Yeah. There we go. So, let's... Uh, we'll just... I won't throw it in there. Go there. Now, let's put the boots on. And do that. Okay. Yep, I was going to say, we did just... I can't even back out the door. So, like I said, the first number has to be positive 339. But this might help us get there a little faster. Um, because, you know, expeditiously. <gasps> word of the day. I dare you to look it up and learn a new word. Expeditiously. Excuse me. Fox. Hey, look at that parkour. That is some awesome parkour right there. Not awesome GPS skills, but awesome parkour. Okay. Now. I know we should head straight for the snow. No snow. Ooh, that rhymes. That's a good one. That's a good one right there. All right. Into I I ran this way. What'd it do? Reach out? Give me a hug? I don't want that kind of hug. Parkour it okay. See, I started to brag and then it didn't work. Oh, oh we go. Make sure we have a semi-sorta of clear path here. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes, we need a clear path. Yeah, like I said, we've, we've got quite a ways to go. And we ended up at this cave off stream, and I was like, oh, new cave, or same cave, but it is not the same cave. So... get us there. I really, really will. And then once I memorize the path and we mark it a little bit, we'll be fine. Okay, so now we're in the snow. Yes, we are, and you can stop growling because I'm not going anywhere. Okay, this is where we, the direction we went. We'll kind of try to follow the same path. See, we made a big mess here. And then we went this way. Basically, the next thing, or next, how did I fall with boots? Explain that. Well, at least I'm filling up my pockets and I won't pick up any more zombie bacon. Okay. Around here somewhere is those, that ice. I mean, we might not be going the exact same path, but as long as we can get that first number down to three, or up, I guess, because it's negative. Yeah, we didn't pass this part of the ice, so we need to go this way. Okay. Yep, here's where I was a minute ago. Oh, these 
leather boots are so, so nice. Is this it? Maybe? It's a lot of snowballs. How did I get... I mean, I remember a tree. Okay. We're just gonna get all excited. This is it. Yep, because there's the emerald, the iron, and the coal. Okay, so that's not even close to the coordinates that I had written down, so... We were actually closer than what I thought. So, let me rewrite these coordinates. I don't know where I even got those coordinates from. And I have misplaced a pen, found one. Because I put my labeled at Monster Cave on my paper. So, negative 218. 116, excuse me, 439. So we were actually close. We were just running in circles around it. I don't understand, but... Ours is not to reason why. Oop. Yeah, because... Oh, yeah. This is it. This is it. Alright. And while we're in here... Okay. We learn something new every day. Carrots also destroyed dripstone. Just saying. And it destroys it, and you still get the drop. Oh, be quiet. I'm just here for the ancient city. I'm not here for you. Now, can we remember how to find the ancient city? Okay, wait a minute. So here's these waterfalls. We did not go back there. Okay, found the skulk. We are close. I think this is it right here. Yep, because there's that weird lava fall. Ooh, let's put a torch here. I mean, not that it honestly matters because there's lava. Okay, I see some torches. One this way. Um, okay. And there's that. Okay. Alright. Yes, it's this direction. Yeah, because I remember thinking this is a cool cobble generator. And we could use that. And then we went this way. And we had all those shushy blocks like right here. And then we went down towards this. And we debated on blocking it off for safety purposes. And if you look right there, get out our eye spy. There it is. We found it. <laughs> okay, that was me trying to have an evil laugh. And narwhals really don't have evil laughs. I did. I slipped and fell. But, you know, it's okay. <sighs> okay, so <laughs> are we seriously going to do this? Are we seriously going to do this again? I mean, do, do we really want to? Shay says yes, but I have a few other viewers, and I, well, I better not do that. And you know, I didn't even check to see if I, okay, so which way? All right, you're going to have to go, because I don't know. I don't even know if I'm hitting it. I did. Thank y'all. Wh Where should we... You know what? Now that I think about this, we should probably enclose some of this. For... To fit the narwhal safety rules. Um... Let's go up here. 
and we'll just grab some cobble. You know, I'm not. We're not going to be picky and make it all fancy. This is just for safety purposes, so we can make our water vader. Okay, we're going to need a lot more than that. You know what? Let's. We could just keep this as a trash can. You go in there. No, seriously. You go. Okay, whatever. Be difficult. We should probably. Oh. Is it if I aim at it? Well, that still didn't work because I can see. Oh my gosh. Give me a minute. We'll get it. We'll throw it in there. Because we need quite a bit to protect us. But my question was, and still is, which side should we do it on? Like, which side should be our main entrance? We'll go back here and look in a minute. And then figure it out. Okay. Why? Okay, maybe if I stand close. I don't want to stand too close. Okay, I see it. Cobble deep slate. Okay. All of that will help me. And I will keep the spruce sapling. Let's set our craft. Oh, you know what? Yes. Let's set our crafting bench. Let's make like a little safety cubicle with a crafting bench. Like we did in the other one, right? And like a single chest. Or not. What do you think? That way, eventually when we have a necessary something. You know. We have a few supplies here. Okay. Let's see. We can move these carrots up. And let's take the cobble. And there. We don't have a door. But we could at least have a torch. Yes, no spawn. Okay. Because this way, if we need to repair anything or whatever, we have a crafting bench at the very least. Wait, where's our other stuff? Yep, we can make one chest. Ta-da! Now. See? Looky there. Now let's take off our leather boots. There. Now we should have a little more protection. Oh, we should have brought that extra oak with us. It's okay. It's okay. Alright, now let's fill in some of this. Let's grab. I'm thinking and then let's do this that's not where I want that I want it on this one and then put this here what do you think that way if we're on this side we can kind of see a torch to hunt up 
there. See? I like that thought. What about you guys? Nope. Down here. Ah, there. That should give us a little more safety. Right? So, we can take some of this out. Yep. Okay, so that... Did I do the wrong side? No, I did the right side. Where'd the other side go? covered up? <coughs> Excuse me. You know, the little walkway thing. Oh, it's down here. Okay. Well, then let's take this out. I wondered. I was so confused. Okay. There. Whoops. Yeah. Because it's also down here where we need to put in safety rails. I don't... It, we're not getting the Black Knight effect, so... Wow, look at... Th there's... Drop that box. Oh my gosh. I think this is going to have so many more trumpet blocks than the other one. Honestly. And then what we can do is come back up here and cover this with carpet. What do you think? Because that way we don't have to... We can make a little bit of noise up here. And it would be okay. That's my thought. Okay. So now let's put torch, torch, yeah. Because that way if we're like way out there, we can use our, like hide for a minute and use our eye spy to, you know, figure out where we're going. But, like I said, here's the question. Where should... Ooh. Oh. Where should we put our bucket of water? I mean, honestly. Um, okay, and I'm still kind of looking for his big TV. I mean, we found the middle part, kind of. Wait, wait, wait. There it is, right there. Yeah. Okay. And so let's make this. Ooh. Let's see if I crouch with this thing, I can't see. But we're going to make this double wide just because. <laughs> oh, I'm almost out. Ooh, scary times. Uh huh. Okay. Here looks like a nice little ledge. And if we keep it in the if we keep it in the middle, maybe. I don't know. But give me a minute. Let me reset the audio because, you know, his big TV is interfering in everything. 
I'll be right back, so hang tight. Okay, I just ran out of stuff. So let's go back up here. And let's get more stuff. Because, like I said, I want to make this as safe as possible. You know? Not taking no chances. But yeah, I'm thinking that side that was right there with the little ledge on it on the side with his TV. That way we don't take a chance in falling in that lava. And it, even though it's a little bit darker, we can still like light the area up with torches. You know? I think that's the best bet. Like, this side. You know, like, right here. Because, yeah, there's a lot of sparkly stuff, and there's that. Uh, trumpet block. But if we go through and light this area up with torches, like, at least a little bit, I think we might be okay. Um, you know, but as always, it's just a risk we have to take. brave narwhals. We are. We're all brave narwhals. All my friends are brave. You know? Even with even with ominous music playing in the background. We're all we're all brave. Okay, so but first let's let's finish setting this up here. Right? Because if we block what's if we block what's scary, it's not scary. Well, it's not because I said so. <laughs> okay, still scary, but much better. <laughs> is that rock? Like it is. It's like a giant cave formation. Huh. Although now that I think about it, remember we discussed that this might be the like side of it because that's just cave wall. See, it's just skulkified. But if we go on that side, that's like everything. Hmm. What questions? But I do see wool. What is that? Well, and there's iron right here, so... What do you guys think right here? I guess we'll do it on this side. Hold on. 
There. I'll... But we'll try to do it as far away from the lava as possible. Maybe right here. Alright, let's see. Okay. I saw it light up. Let's go put that here. Okay. Because mostly right now what we would need is our sword. Okay, so I think we're going to be far enough away from the... We ended up in another walkway, guys. Let's start crouching now. Just for safety purposes. <laughs> okay. Now there's still going to be a lot of whispering. Oh. Okay. So that was gravel. <laughs> Let's try to keep track of what ores we find. Because I'm not going to get it out now. Okay. And I may bring back like several buckets of water so we can eliminate this. But for now... We're going to place some extra safety blocks here. Okay. Alright. We're going to... First things first, we need to find those columns of wool. And obviously be very careful where we place our torches. To not send off any shushy blocks. Found the wool and a shushi block. Let us eliminate that. Oh, okay. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay, so first things first. Let's just take out the trumpet block. <laughs> oh my word. Oh my gosh! Okay. So, this one is much, much worse than, um, mm -hmm. the other one. Just throwing that out there. Because we are trumpet blocks every, I don't know, two blocks? <laughs> But I think we're already on strike two. <laughs> so, you know. Yeah. But we're going to grab a bunch of the wool. And we're going to attempt to cover up these trumpet blocks. Oh. How did we get ourselves into this mess again? Okay. Now I think this is the spot with the other shushy block. Yep. There's the old shushy block. Oh, there's several shushy blocks. Oh. Well, get something to drink, get comfortable, because this is going to be a while. Because I want to make sure that we got enough wool or at least something to... Oh. Okay. And we next time we'll bring shears. Uh, okay. 
Should we try to set a torch down? Okay, well, that didn't set off the shushy blocks, so I think we're alright. We're gonna need a lot of wool. Okay, so how many times are we gonna die in this ancient city? My guess is eight. Eight total before we get all the trumpet blocks. Uh, Papa Narwhal agreed with me about the eight. Oh, no, wait, he said nine, sorry. I forgot to count it on my toes. Hold on a minute. I'll be right back. Sorry guys, this isn't going to work out again tonight. Um, I'll try again tomorrow night and uh, we'll hope for the best. I'll put myself in a safety cubicle and I guess I'll see you tomorrow night.
Thanks for stopping by.